Hello everybody and welcome back to the Mega Modded series. We are jumping in again on a little old two-win streak. We're going to jump in and try... Oh. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Depression fills my soul. Anyways. Ooh, I say that and then you give me a little bit of the parasitoid on the cellar. That is quite fitting. Quite fitting indeed. And do you know what? I'm going to start out the question of the day real, real early here. Right at the start of the episode because I've just got one fresh in my head. What is your favourite biblical reference in Isaac? Weird question for someone that isn't religious. And yeah, I'm not religious either. So, But yeah, there's a lot of obviously biblical references in Isaac. In fact, it's just like a wholeheartedly biblical game. But there's definitely some that are uh, more interesting than others. Uh, so I do wonder what yours is. And I'm actually trying to think of what my favourite is now. And I'm really not sure. It's it's very difficult to say, actually. Ooh, hello. Um, one minute. Let's quickly just do this. <laughs> oh, that was close. <laughs> Wait, what? That tinted rock gave us a grey chest. Ooh, ow. Um, excuse me. But it did give me a black heart, so I can't complain too much. Right, uh, I think the secret room here. There you go, there you go. Let me get some money. We're going to bomb you as well. Do you know what? Let's at least bomb some mushrooms as well. Why not? Take the pill. Feels like I'm walking on sunshine. Yeah, I'm trying to think what mine is. It's, it's, it's difficult to say. I Like, I just... I really like the the sort of the lamb and like uh, and like the Satan themes on the shell floor and onwards. I think they're some of the really cool stuff. I know that's like super sort of generic and not very like super interesting religious um, stuff, but still, I, I still think those are some really really cool. Uh, what the foil? Um, we also got a, a Joker question mark. Okay, we got traveling salesman. Wait, I think we've got multiple traveling salesmen here. Uh, Stompy, Temporary Invincibility, Spawns... Oh my god, we got some crazy stuff going on here. Okay, so... Let's go boom. One of every beggar, you know. You know how it be. Uh, Travelling Salesmen, we've got two of those. So I guess one of these we just pop down here. Oh, it's creatine. Is that a free soul heart? Hell yeah. <laughs> it's literally free. Um, creatine powders there as well. Probably shouldn't have done this with, like, so much crap in the way. These guys are getting bombed. Ooh, we got a giant cell heart. Um, oh, I think we managed to ac accidentally hit the uh, thingy beggar. Uh, yeah, we got a cell heart here. So we're going to get some... Ease our mini Isaacs. I did disable the dynamic mini Isaacs thing, by the way. The one that makes it so... We also got a free key here as well. The one that makes it so that they get out here effects. It was definitely... Excuse me. It was definitely causing some of the lag we were having. Um, we also got another traveling salesman here. Okay, this is tricky. So, hmm. I think the, the real thing to do here is just do this. I realize it's going to fill the room with troll bombs again. Stay away from me as all. Well. Okay. Right. First things first. Let's go see if we can buy creatine powder somehow. Also, can we get... We can't get to that tinted rock, can we? Okay. Right. So let's just go in here. Some crazy... Why is everything free? What? What the heck? Why is everything free? <laughs> um. Um. What? I mean. Okay, I guess. <laughs> I'm not. I'm. I, I'm really completely unaware as to why that's free. But there you go. Um. Now I'm a little concerned. Because we had an item in our last run that had this same effect. But that was in our last run. <laughs> so... Yeah. 
Um, there is a small potential that we now permanently have everything but items free in shops. If it affects this floor as well, then we know something's balked and I'm going to have to go and find the developer and let them know. Because, yeah, that's not that's not right. Oh, look at the little Ezels. Look at them go. They're little cuties. Oh, they're, they're just like the best little tykes you've ever seen. They ain't that strong. They ain't that powerful. But my god, they are mighty. Also, Parasitoid Tears. Oh my god, they're amazing. They're so good. Right. Yeah, um, someone really broke... So this, this run's pretty much a gimme. Um... This runs uh, one second. I've got to I've got to go and do some do some research here. One second. Okay, so I have alerted the authorities. I have alerted alerted the creators of the Ipecac mod because that's what the trinket's from. I'm not sure if it's something to do with the way that I obtained the the trinket through that because uh, I, I obtained it through that trinket uh, through that item that smelts four random trinkets onto you. Maybe there was a bug with that. But yeah, so just from now on, until that bug is fixed, all of our shops are free. <laughs> um, yeah, that's uh, quite quite a significant problem. Ooh, look, a free solar. <laughs> Basically, everything that isn't an item is always going to be free. Yeah, re I really hope they can get on this and fix it very, very quickly, because it's kind of broken. Because the thing is, I, I could abstain from abusing it, but then I can no longer buy anything other than items from shops. And that's not good, because I buy cards and soul hearts and sometimes keys and bombs from shops pretty regularly. So I, I can't really be just abstaining from taking stuff from shops entirely. That doesn't really work. Uh, so yeah, really, um, really hoping that can be fixed like yesterday. <laughs> Hopefully by the time you guys watch this, it'll already be fixed. But yeah, at the minute, like, if we find a shop with a restock machine in it, it's game over, man. We got a little Doppler here. Gotta give the Doppler to you because it just looks like you. I can't remember what the Doppler does, to be honest, but he's just chilling. Uh, once we get a few more, um, like, hearts going on in terms of red health, I'm, um, I'm gonna see if we can use our reverse Joker and take a black market for a little run around. Uh, right, secret room is likely to be here, although it could also be here. Ooh, was that tinted drop in there too? Yes, it was, nice. Oh my God, it always moves the wrong one. I always think it's gonna move uh, Jacob and it moves Ezo. Alrighty then. We got the coupon now as well. So now everything's free. <laughs> now everything's free. Okay. That was unexpected, but pretty awesome. What's in here? So Sackhead's a Sackhead's a decent freebie. Let's let's grab Sackhead. Because we do have batteries about, right? Wait, did that turn my battery into a sack? I, th I swear, I swore there was a battery in here. That's kind of annoying. Please don't turn all of these into, uh, into batteries, into sacks, please. Because I kind of did want the batteries. Where, where are all my batteries at? Were they in here? Okay. Okie dokie. Right, let's keep it moving. I was hoping to get to use my coupon on the devil deal here, because I had a battery charge available, at least I thought I did, but I don't, so... Not quite going to work out the way I want it, it's going to be one charge off. I suppose I could go to my curse room on the off chance that I get a room that has enemies in it. I probably should do that, actually, although I've already committed to the boss fight now, so I'll lose my devil deal nonetheless. Big sad. I suppose there could be enemies in the devil deal. Ooh, hello. There is not. But then again, there's also not really anything I want here. Although, hmm, Bloody Harvest plus Coupon. 
pretty good deal. I will take. It's free. <laughs> Why is it free? <laughs> this is so dumb. Oh my lord, this is so dumb. Oh my god. We done broke everything. Hopefully it'll be fixed on the next run. But right now, we kind of stuck in with the uh, with the, the, the very much brokenness of this. Whoa. That was a lot of explosions. One more you left. This has become quite the run, hasn't it? This has become quite the run. I was not expecting this, but it is very, very spicy. We've got uh, a lot of a lot of uh, freebie-related stuff going on as well. Everything's kind of built up towards this freebie-based run, and I think I like it. It's definitely too broken, but I do think I like it. Right, so we go like that. Okay, so the pill is not free for some reason. I don't know why the one in the shop was free. Uh, the one in the boss room, sorry, not the shop. I don't really know why Jacob and Izao have different look stats. Does that really... Does it? What? How does it determine which look stat it uses? It kind of feels like they should have the same look stat the way that they have the same speed stat. I don't really get it. But you're kind of annoying, but not too bad. Either way, our luck seems to be decent, because even though our luck isn't, but we're getting a lot of drops. Excuse me, sir. Why'd you go the long way around? Kind of trying to avoid me? Ooh, cancer. Got to deal with this room again. Uh, who do you want to have cancer? Probably you. Because you need the HP. Really like to get a red heart for him prior to doing anything with the black market, though. Ow. Not friendly. I'll check out a shop here. Wait. They cost things now. Wait, what? Okay, one moment. One moment. Okay. Strange. Very strange. Anyways. First of all, I think we'll pop. We'll pop this. Ooh. I did not consider this. Not good. <laughs> I guess we'll also... We can't even get back into the shop. BBF is being a BB bitch. <laughs> God damn it. I've got a sack here as well. Where's all my freebies gone? Right, let's 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 pop this Joker card. Ooh, this is looking rather interesting. Why does everything cost soul hearts here? Heck. Um Just see You've gotta be kidding me. <laughs> Wait. Am I stuck here now? No, I'm not. I'm not. That's not. That's not. That's not okay. Um, I don't know how, how what the card is. I can't remember now. Give no spawn five point three zero zero point no from point five. No. Point five. There we go. You're not screwing me out of this floor game. You can go away. Not fair. I didn't even buy anything anyways. You, were, you betrayed me. I love having con. I know that some people see it as cheating, but I like having console commands on for stuff like that. I realized that, like, that's kind of part of the risk you take when you use cards that you don't know what they, have, they do. But still, I really didn't think that it would stop me accessing the rest of the floor. I thought it would be like the teleporting to a crawl space sort of thing where it would just have an exit. But it doesn't, so... Synth oil. Well, I guess we're just leaving then. This 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 floor went pretty horribly.
Oh god. Almost got hit by that dude there. But yeah, we no longer have infinite purchasing power. We are still pretty strong though. This is still a very good run. We got a lot of damage ups so far and good amount of HP. Bye bye. I don't want that trinket. It is a pretty good trinket, but it's not my style right now. Ooh, ooh, ooh that fly almost walked right into it. Just want to try and get some mushies. Oh my god, stop splitting up, guys. Please. Super frustrating when you do that. The leeches are in. Okay, we power through. And then we go... Boom. Just a pill. Yeah, I don't know why it just suddenly stopped. If anyone can see what happened, let me know. Because it'll be very important for the developers. Despite, like I said, it might already be fixed by the time you're watching this. Still, it's worth noting in case it's not. Ow. We can go boom. Really? The same pill again? I really need to be very careful about where I spawn these things. I'm spawning them in very promiscuous positions. Very problematic positions. Ooh, we got a cell heart again. Uh, I want the Ezo ones again. The Ezo ones are cute. They is some cuties. Apparently those cell hearts as well, they only work if you if you have full red hearts or can't pick up red health. Like if you if you find them and you you're missing red health and pick it up, it'll just act as a normal heart and spawn no uh, cells. Check in here. Ooh, very good trinket. Don't think it matters which one of us picks this up. Right. Got you. An item room. What do you hold for me? Item rooms. I was about to say, item rooms have been really good for us so far. And that is not stopping now. Ah, shit. I just took it as, um, as Jacob because he has a higher fire rate. But then I realized there's a bit of a negative interaction. If you get a parasitoid tier, there's also a bugger tier. It won't actually trigger and create spiders or flies. So it's a little bit of an anti-synergy. It's, it's very minor. It won't matter that much because they still trigger independently of each other from um, more often than not. But when they trigger at the same time, it does unfortunately pre prevent one from working. Okay, so there's a free guppy item. Also glowing hourglass. Glowing hourglass is good, but I don't really think it's necessary for us right now. We are just killing it right now, though. Things are going well. Ooh, also, something I completely forgot to do here, which I should do right now, is I installed a new mod called, like, Anti, like, I think it's Clear Tier Button. There you go. Clear Tiers on Room Clear. Um, clear Tier Button 91. Uh, I think it does say in the workshop which button relates to which. So 91 is left and right brackets. So, if, in theory, if we go like this and then press... Okay, that did not work. Uh, oh, there you go. If we press this bracket button, it just deletes every tier on the screen. It Basically, it's in, in that situation we had last run where we just we were lagging like crazy because we just had so many tiers on screen, it fixes situations like that. Um, I don't really care who gets that. No one really needs range. Right, let's keep it going. This is a great, great, great little uh, run we got going here. We just got some fantastic items so far. Simple as. I mean, we did also kickstart this run with just a ton of freebies, which is really nice. I really like this um, this Bloody Harvest plus coupon synergy we have going on right now, though. Hey, another sell heart. I, I gotta say, ten, the, I was just talking to the developer before this run, after my Andromeda run that you guys saw yesterday, and saying that, hey, 10% chance might be a little high. 
And they said, oh, no, in testing, 10% was fine. In some runs, it was rare that I even found one. And I was like, nah, I still think 10 is quite high. And it's proving to still be. I don't know if it's just YouTuber luck or what. But we found three so far on this run. And we're not even halfway through the run yet. Like, that's pretty common. I mean, the, the one thing is the, the, the um, like, little cell dudes aren't very strong. They die reasonably quickly and don't do a lot of damage, especially if you don't have dynamic mini tiers on, so that's fine. Also, we can get ourselves a free little baby here. Um, yes. We got little spewer and the lantern. So let's pop... Ah, oh, shit. Pop the wrong one. Still, doesn't matter because we didn't actually end up getting anything. But now, if we get a devil deal, which we very... Actually, which we definitely will, we won't have a charge. So we have to complete a bunch of rooms before we do that now. It's not what I intended, as you can probably imagine. Oh, the little hopper dudes jumping around all over the place. Luckily, we do have cancer with uh, ease out, so we can survive a few extra hits here and there. Yeah, let's hope we can get uh, coupon charged back up. Okay, we'll grab that. Yes, please. Black Candle's awesome for us here. Right. Oh, it's Baby Bernie. Baby Ezel versus Baby Bernie. Oh, no, I think Baby Ezel's dead. <laughs> Whoops. Sorry, Baby Ezel. It was not your time to shine, apparently. It was not your time to shine. One thing I've got to say that I genuinely love with all my heart is that mod developers, um, especially room creators, have not deemed it fit for those little green flies to be in many custom rooms because I think everyone just hates them. And so I very rarely see them anymore as compared to vanilla. And god damn in vanilla, they were reasonably common and very annoying. Oh, that was a secret room, but apparently not. So we do have two rooms left here. As long as they have combat in them, we can uh, get our charge back. Another key there. We're on 13 keys. I don't really care. Oh, God. Ooh, hello. Yeah, definitely take that. Right, let's go do our boss. Let's go to the boss, and hopefully our devil deal contains some good stuff that we can coupon to uh, access for free. I was like, what the hell's the charge bar in the middle? Then I realized it's a little spewer. Why do we keep getting hit on Ezel, by the way? I say that as Jacob gets hit. I hate this boss. This room layer is really bad for it as well. Uh, I think you can have the fire rate. That's new. Damage up for the current floor. Hmm. I, I like it, but I really like the synergy we have going on between our two actives right now. While items aren't that common from Bloody Harvest, they do appear often enough for it to be worth keeping. You see what I mean there? Look at that parasitoid tear that's just stuck on his face. What the hell's going on in this room? Oh, we've got like one of those little creep dudes underneath our feet. I'm like, why the hell am I constantly slowed down here? One of these little faces underneath us. Ooh, a black sack. Ah, oh, really? A black sack that gives you no HP is just depressing. Hello there. Now I'm just going to not lose that. Okay, that dude jumped straight into death. Check this out. Ooh, very good stuff here. And hit. here it is, look. Special offer. It's back. It's back with a vengeance. Um, right. So. What do I want to do here? First of all, I think I want to pop that. Then I think I do want this, just because I know it's broken. I know that I shouldn't be taking it if I know it's broken, but can you blame me, really? 
Do, 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 do. Bit of a champion belt. Ooh, Vegemite, no thank you. I love it. I'm probably ha I do absolutely butchering it. It's a terrible rendition, but there you go. Oh my god, Th this run is like, it's got some of my favourite elements. I absolutely love Parasitoid Tears. I absolutely love Bugger Tears. Oh god. Uh, oh, I lo did I lose my Eternal Heart then? No, I didn't. I'm stupid. Uh... Oh, the the what the f- There's still enemies alive in this room. Why did they wait so long to decide to attack then? God damn, we are getting some good stuff. Who's got the best tier rate? I mean, neither of you have great tier rate, but you have less tier effects. So I think that you should take this. Yeah, these green flies. Thank God they're not as common anymore. And we can go... Boom. No, thank you. I hate this room. These guys are going to jump directly on my face, aren't they? You did try, sir. You did try. Voodoo head. Voodoo mama juju. Take it. Right, now we've got to see if everything's free forever. Right. Mum shouldn't be too hard here. We have plenty of damage. Oh, she's red mum there. I did not pick up on that until just after she stomped on my fist. Oh, God. There's rocks, too. This is this is real bad. That rock needs to go. We are not killing her anywhere near as fast as I thought we would be for what we've got going on right now. I thought she'd be annihilated by our damage, but... She's merely getting pummeled. There you go. Right. I think we want to do this, don't we? Yes. Right, let's go. This this run's got... It's got me worried a little bit. We definitely, definitely have... A chance to die on this run, especially considering we have a rotten heart as he's out as Jacob right now. That's not good. But the damage output here is good. Okay, so that is free. It's the chariot card. Now the question is: is the next thing free? If the next thing's free, then it's broken again. Yeah, then we know it's busted once more. You are dead too. Yay! See, another giant cell one. This time we'll go with uh, go, go with good old Jacob. Jacob can have some babies of his own. Which is a weird sentence that I wish I've never, I'd never said. Ooh, this guy's got a death marker on him. Just do that to clear out the room. Right, so now we pop this again. Okay, now it costs. Okay, we seem to have reset it. I don't know what broke it before. I'm going to have to, like, review the footage and see what exactly what caused the break. Okay, we did lose quite a lot of HP on Ezel there from hitting our Rotten Heart. I do not like the fact that this guy's a champion. It's scaring me deeply. Really, it's a heart over there. We're scraping by. We are very much scraping by. I think the guppy's collar bug with the infinite lives got fixed, right? And the nine lives bug as well. Ah, shit. Oh, God. We got hit on Ezo as well. Jacob, even. Is that a door mimic there? I think it is, isn't it? Dude, I got hit on him again. Are you kidding me? Rune bag's nice. That's good. Oh, 
I'm a little depressed here because we're gonna die pretty quickly. Like this, this boss could just insta kill us. Oh my god. Okay, you need that. That was a good save. Also, you take this? I'm I'm gonna keep this now because the fly damage we have is pretty absurd. And the bloody harvest is good and it did it did just provide a great item, but I have to I have to put my best interests first and try this out. I can't believe we got a rainbow heart there to save me. I had to use the chariot card there. I'm glad I remembered I had it, I'll be honest. I'm liking this herming. This herming's good. Yeah, Gubby's head here should really, really help us out. Oh, God. Yeah, that's, that's despicable. What human did this? We got a full card here, I think. Ace of spades, a hermit card. Could really use some soul hearts around about now. Right. Don't want that. We haven't had any uh, wisps yet, right? Don't remember having any. Right, just keep moving. We'll be good. Okay. Might be a soul heart in here. Just got a prayer. Damn it. We should probably destroy some skulls, though, actually. Just in case. We did get a sack, at least. No black heart, but... Kind of annoying, because that means that sack replaced either a card or a black heart, which both would have been better than a sack. Yera. Okay, Yera is probably going to be reserved for just finding a single soul heart and duplicating it, I'll be honest. I don't know if we're going to make it to... Oh, we're supposed to be going to the beast. Well, that ship has somewhat sailed. Is that a rainbow boy? Yeah, it is. He didn't even drop jack shit. Oh shit. Oh god damn it. Why do I keep getting hit on Ezao? Oh my god. It's so frustrating when you just keep getting hit on the character with the lowest HP. It's like, you know what you're doing, game. Just stop. Come on. Damn it. These things dying. Die, big babies. Die. Okay, yet another very scary boss, which we very easily could die on. Okay. Get Jacob in front as to act as a shield. Hope no damage befalls us. Still got hit, good. Check out the devil deal. Take nothing, sadly. Oh, and absolutely bounce. Oh, God, I'm scared. This run is so so nearly coming to an end. Goddamn. We are on the brink of destruction. The brink of despair. And I don't know how long we can survive. Oh, God. I say that and then get, a, yeah, get an absolutely horrendous room. We got the proc, but it, that doesn't really save us. 
Dude, this is legit impossible. <laughs> I I can't go through that room. I can't go through that room. That room is actually impossible. Also, so is this one. What the hell? Okay, that wasn't so bad. I really hope it's this way. Because we cannot afford to go through that other room. Damn it. I immediately get health and the game is immediately like... Soik? You thought? Nope. <laughs> Bail? Oh no. It's going to make me go through that room, isn't it? I can. I cannot physically survive that room. That room is evil. Pure evil. I don't know who made it. I think it's just that they're champions that's making it tough. Oh, wait. And we might be okay. That was close. Oh, no. Wait. Hmm. I think we might be bugged. I've, I've, I've... There's a potential that we're bugged here. Either that or I'm just getting really lucky with my uh, with my current Jacob, uh, my, my current Guppy's collar procs. But that's three times in a row now. <laughs> Makes me a little suspicious. Okay, this is looking promising for going the right way. I don't mean as in a surviving. In that, in that regard, it's not promising at all. Um, ooh, yeah, I'll take that. Chance for Godhead Tears is pretty awesome. Whoa, uh, what the hell? <laughs> Excuse me, sir. You can't fly. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, God. Hmm. Yeah, some purple fires. I need ways to get around these fires. I don't even know what's left in this room. This is... Oh, God, this is gross. No, 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 no. This is, this is death. This is death. Bernie, thank you. And you as well, sir. Get over here. Dude, <laughs> just get over here or die either way. Okay, thank you for alerting me about that dead end. No, no, we're so screwed. We have to go through the other room. It don't matter how many rooms we survive now, we're balked. If I die to that, I'm going to be so annoyed. You little bitch. Who made that room? Curse you. You devil. You little devil. Anyways. That ends that run. We, we, had, a good, we had a good time, but goddamn. Jacob and Ezo are evil. Either way, hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys in the next one.